Hey, I'm Subi Homemaker and welcome back to my kitchen. Today we're making cracked wheat bread. This was my mom's special bread that she made all the time for us. It is very hearty, nutty, has lots of really wholesome ingredients like oatmeal, cracked wheat, whole wheat, and honey. The full recipe is on the blog. Let's get baking. In a large standing mixer, combine the yeast, sugar, and warm water. Be careful to use warm water, not hot. If the water is too hot, the yeast will disappear. Mix and let sit for about 15 minutes to get the yeast working. After the yeast is activated, add the honey, oil, salt, and cold water. Stir and then attach a dough hook. Next add the oats, the whole wheat flour, and cracked wheat. Mix until well absorbed. Then add about half of the all-purpose flour. Start the mixer and gradually add more flour. You want the bread dough to be slightly sticky, but not too much. When you touch the dough, it should bounce back slightly. Grease a large bowl with oil and add the dough to the bowl, making sure the smooth side is up. Cover the dough with a clean dish towel and set it in a warm corner of your kitchen. Let the dough rise until doubled in size. After the dough has doubled in size, punch it down and shape it back into a ball, placing it in a bowl with the smooth side up. When doubled again, form the dough into oblong shapes to fit three greased bread pans. Place them in the pans and cover with a towel and let rise again until about doubled in size. Bake the loaves on 350 degrees for about 35 to 40 minutes or until the bottoms are nicely browned. Remove the bread from the pans and place on cooling racks. Brush the tops with butter. This bread stores nicely in the freezer for several months. Hey, it's you again. If you like this video, leave me a thumbs up and a comment below. Also, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on all the new videos coming up. See you next Tuesday.